You need a financial advisor with the freedom to focus on your specific needs. Whatever your goals, Reed Potter can create a game plan tailored to you. Call Reed at 432-0777 at Pikeville, Kentucky to learn more. On Wednesday, April 12th, Kentucky State Police hosted their Cover the Cruiser event at the Pikeville Walmart. Pedestrians were able to stop by their booth and donate a minimum of $1 to show their support for the Kentucky Special Olympics and put their name on the cruiser. So far, the event has raised nearly $50,000 in only a few years. Yeah, so we're out at Pikeville Walmart today uh, doing the Cover the Cruiser event. Uh, the Cover the Cruiser event was started in 2020 when the law enforcement torch run was canceled. Uh, so the state police still wanted to be involved with the Special Olympics somehow, so we came for the Cover the Cruiser to kind of offset uh, the Torch Run being canceled that year. Since 2020, we raised over $47,000 for the Kentucky Special Olympics. Uh, all the money today goes to the Special Olympics. You can come out here and for a minimum of a $1 donation, you can fill out a card, your name on it, and we're trying to cover the entire cruiser today just to show our support to the Special Olympics and help raise funds for them. The Kentucky Special Olympics athletes are thankful for KSB showing their support. At the end of the competition, officers award the winners their medals themselves. It makes me feel very good, especially when I was afraid of cops and I'm starting to be able to get to where I get to be able to be around the cops and get used to them. I think the cops are there for us, when, especially when we go there and work out with them. And the cops does everything they can for us. They give us the models at the end, which makes us more happy at the end. When, and we work towards the end so we could be with the police officers and get our medals. The Kentucky State Police has been involved with the Special Olympics for many years, uh, attending the games and handing out ribbons to the athletes there when they have the games. Uh, so to kind of see this come full circle, you go from the fundraising, raising money for those events, to be able to go to the games and actually see the athletes out there and be able to give them the ribbon. Uh, like I said, it's, it's just full circle. Reporting for Mountaintop News, I'm Nick Collum.